ಮಂದೇಹಂ ಶ್ರೀಗುರು The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, 5th Canto, 6th Chapter, Text No. 8, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on the 30th of November, 1976, in Vrindavan, India. Shri Rupa While he was wandering about, a wild forest fire began. This fire was caused by the friction of bamboos, which were being blown by the wind. In that fire, the entire forest near Kutachala and the body of Lord Rishabdeva were burnt to ashes. Asa samira bheda bhiruta benu bhikanda jatha javanala ಡಿ ಗೋಸ್ ಟು ಸೆಟ್ ಒನಲ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಫಾರೆಸ್ಟ್ I saw Dhavanala first in my experience, Nainital station, very high hill, and there was fire, blazing fire, upon the hill. Nobody went there to set fire, but there was fire. So how that fire takes place, that is explained here. Samira Veva Vidhuta Venu Vikara Salam the big jungles there are bamboo trees and they are very densely situated when there is wind very forceful the friction causes fire so similarly this material world is compared with this davana samshar davana nobody wants that there will be trouble in your country there is another kind of fire that is not davanala in the city there is electric nala <laughs> and especially in new york you know 24 hours the fire brigade is working dang 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 nobody wanted but there is fire just to prove that you people you have avoided jungle life but you cannot avoid dawana law this is you can make an enemy very large arrangement for living comfortably but you cannot escape dhavana it is not possible therefore samasara dhavana lali the whole material world is blazing fire samasara dhavana lali loka trana karana gana gana tyam now this dhavana the strength in the forest you cannot send your fire brigade that is not possible neither you can go there to help the animals for extinguishing the fire by bucket full of water that is also not possible helpless similarly the samsara dhavana la you cannot extinguish it hmm. the how it will extinguish samsara dama nalali tranaya karuna gana gana he has to beg for the mercy of krishna then this blazing fire can extinguish 
not by your arrangement. That's not possible. Prana karunna ghanagharat. That cloud is mercy cloud, not this ordinary cloud. Because Ramanala, the example, personal experience, there are the hill of Nainita, some thousand feet high. How this fire will be extinguished? The extinguished it will be when there is cloud on the sky and there is rainfall. Otherwise it is not possible. Similarly, the mercy cloud, karuna, karuna, ghana ghanat. So, this like ordinary cloud is made possible by evaporating water from the sea. Similarly, Krishna has the sea of mercy. Karunama, Karuna Sagar. Krishna Sagar's name is Karuna So, as the air evaporates or the heat evaporates from the sea and the cloud is formed in the sky, similarly, one who has connection or the power to evaporate the mercy sea of Krishna, he can extinguish the samsara dhāvā. And that is Guru. Guru is the cloud or he is the agent of drawing water from the ocean of mercy of Krishna and turn it into a mercy cloud and pour water on the samsara dhāvānana, and then it is extinguished. Samsara dhāvānana dīvalu prāṇāya kārunna ghanārana prāptasya kalyāna. Therefore, Guru must be authorized person, not that. Bhumi for Guru, no. I am Guru, no. You cannot become Guru. Unless you are agent to draw the mercy water from the ocean of mercy of Krishna. So therefore, Guru is not an ordinary person. He is the representative, bona fide representative of Krishna. Bhaktivinoda Thakur has sung, Krishna se tomar Krishna dite par. Vaishnava Thakur. Krishna is your property. If you like, you can. Vedesu durlava, adurlava apa bhakto. You cannot get Krishna by studying Vedas. That is not possible. There is Krishna in the Vedas, but you cannot pick up. It is not possible. But if you go to the Krishna's favorite person, Kintu Prahorja Priya Evakasya. Krishna's very dear servant, confidential servant, he is Guru. Nobody can become Guru unless he is in confidence of Krishna. Nachita Smat Manu says to Kastrit Me Priya Krishna. These things are there. Uh, not that by magic. One can become guru. No. He must be Anusara Dhamma Naladi Yoga Pranayaka Ganagana Prapta Sakalyana. Everything is there in the Shastra. We have to see whether a person is actually bona fide agent of Krishna, then we accept him as guru. Otherwise, it is useless. Waste of time. Guru Rupi Ampalik Krishna, Kaja Kaja Majana. Guru is very confidential. Sakshadharitena samastha sastrai rukta sathabhavata eva sadhi. Guru is sakshadhari. There is no distinction between Guru 
Hare Krishna. Just like if you have got some business with a very big man, uh, when he is represented, he comes, you treat him as the same person because he is authorized agent. That is natural. Just like in India, during British day, the governor general, Bhaisroy, his name was Bhaisroy. So people treated him exactly like the king, Bhaisroy, in place of the king. Although he was a servant, but still the honor was given to him just like the king. His dress was like king, he was given honor like king, wherever he goes, he was received like the king. But he is not king. He does not say that I am king. But his honor is like the king. Saksha Karitena Samastha Shastra Rupta. It is said in all that you sing all of Vedega Jahara Charit. Read this verse daily. Guru Mukha, Bede Gai, Jahara Chai, what is that? Who can sing this? Guru Mukha, Padma Bhakya, Bede Gai, Jahara Chai. Bede Gai, Jahara Chai. This is according to, strictly according to the version of the day. Sakshat, you will see, this is not from Nasthago, he is singing. Bede Gai, Jahara Chai. And Vishnana Chakra Sri Thakur, he is also saying, Sakshad Haritin or Samasthasad. So there is no difference. Not that one Acharya will say, I have seen so-called Acharya, not real Acharya. I have seen in dream, the other day the letter can, he has seen, realized in dream, Nitayo Radesh. This is not the process. Process is the Shastra authority. That is weird. Not that jugglery. I have seen in dream. I have to become guru. No. Whether you are actually in terms of the Shastra, whether actually you are dear to Krishna, you are most confidential servant, that we have to test. And what is the confidential servant of Krishna? Everything is explained. Krishna says, Jaivam paramanguyam madhakti shavilas. This paramanguyam. What is that paramanguyam? Sarva dharmaan parittajya mame kang This is paramanguyam. Krishna says, Guyad guyatam. What is that verse? Who can say? Just before saying, Sarva dharmaan parittajya. Krishna says that you are my very dear friend. Therefore I am talking to you the most confidential part of knowledge. Is it not? What is that confidential part? Serve that man with you. Give up everything. Simply surrender. This is confidential knowledge. Yana, karma, yoga. This will not help. It will take some time. You can waste your time in that way. You are at liberty. But real dharma is that you fully surrender to me. Don't talk nonsense. Arjun was talking so many nonsense things. So Krishna ultimately said, My dear Arjun, you are my confidential friend. Therefore, I am asking you to do this. Don't waste your time. It will not help. It will help. Bhavanam janvanam ante. You can go on with your learning, with your study of Vedas, with your practice of yoga or ritualistic ceremonies, karma kanda, jana kanda. But unless you come to this point, sattva dharma anpalitya jama me there is no happiness. That is not possible. This is the conflict. So with this confidential knowledge, one who preaches without any compromise, he is the confidential servant of Krishna. There is no compromise. This is 
real really happy. Krishna says, Nachatasma Atmana Shesu, Kastitmi Priyadita. So, this is the person who has received the authority to draw a mercy water from the ocean of mercy of Krishna. Kapsar Haritena Samasma Sastri. And what Krishna said five thousand years ago, the same thing, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, same thing, there was no change. As there was no change between the statement of Vishnu Chakravati Thakur and Narakamila Thakur. Hmm? Sadhu Shastra. As Shastra there is no change. Not that modernized the Shastra should be changed. No, that is not change. That is not Shastra. Shastra cannot be changed. Circumstantially it will be changed. Seasonal changes. No, that is not Shastra. Shastra means it is what Krishna. What Krishna said five thousand years ago, or Krishna said some forty millions of years ago to the sun god, Imam Vivasati Yugam Pratavana Hamamba. He says, I am talking to you with that Puratanam Yuga. Not that because it has passed millions of years and now it is a different time. So I'll have to change. No, he said, I am talking to you, that very old system. Is it not? Yes. God's word cannot be changed. Uh, then what is the difference between God and ourselves? Eh? He is always perfect. He is always perfect. What he said forty million years ago, what he said five thousand years ago, that is also correct up to date. That is also. Not that so many years have passed and it has become old. Now let us reform it and put it into new way. Now you can put the same thing in a new way, but you cannot change the principle. Sadhu Shastra Guru Bhakko Tinete Kuriya Uhiko. Shastra is never changed. And the Sadhu. Sadhu means who follows this Shastra. He is Sadhu. He also does not change. Sadhu Sadhu. And Guru, Guru means who follows this Shastra and Sadhu. They are three, the same. A Guru will not change. That it was spoken five thousand years ago. That is not applicable now. Now I am giving you something new, generally. He is useless. Sadhu Shastra Guru Bhakta Tinita Kuriya Vikka. The Shastra Vidhimu Sitya Bhattati Kamaka. Nasit things have happened. These things are there. So, the Samsara Dhavana Ladira Loka, his eight stanzas of Vishnu Chakravarti Chakravarti is very important. We sing daily. That's very good. So, this is, this word is Dhavana. Just like you saw there. He wanted fire. He did not require any matches. No. By his will, they will require. Formerly, Jagga fire was also ignited. What is that? Wood. Eh? Arani, yes. Not with matches. So, it is ordinary thing. The friction of the bamboo, electricity, it creates electricity. Uh, by friction. The electricity is also friction. Similarly, fire is created and the dry leaves of bamboo tree, they set in fire, then gradually the whole forest is in blazing fire. And especially the snakes, they are the first sufferers because they remain on the ground and there are dry leaves and it takes fire very quickly, then they cannot fly away. Other uh, animals, they can, nobody can escape, but they can try because they can go fast. But this snake, similarly, when there is catastrophe in the world, the persons 
like snakes, cruel, envious, they suffer most. Like this name. Chanaka Pandit has said, Sattva Krura Khala Krura. There are two envious living entities, very dangerous. What are they? The one is snake. Another, the man whose habit is like snake. Without any fault, he'll bite. Without any fault. So, it's like we are preaching Krishna consciousness. So, what is our fault? That we are trying to make man no illicit sex, no gambling, no meat eating, no intoxication, and they take it otherwise. They take it very dangerous. Without any fault, they are finding fault. This is not sattva kura khala kura. No fault, but still fault finding and giving us trouble. So you will find so many persons without any fault, they bite. The snake, without any fault, you are passing, you are taking some fruit from the tree, if there is snake, it will bite. The kuro. So Chanakapandi says there are two kinds of kuro, envious living entities. One is the snake, and the, the man snake, or a man habituated to the snake quality. The sattva krura khala krura. But Chanakapandi said this man snake is more dangerous than the animal snake. Sattva kuratara khala. Why? The mantra sadivasa sattva khala kena nimarjati. You can subdue the snake by chanting the snake mantra or some drug, uh, jari but this man snake cannot be subdued. It is very, very dangerous. So, this is our position. Therefore, a creature devotee is so favorable to Krishna. They have to meet, actually. Then there is person, crude of persons. Uh, let's see, Jesus Christ, what fault he had? He was preaching about God and he was crucified. Crucified. That is in your country. Very good example. Simply his fault was his talking of God. That's all. And he was crucified. So you have to meet. Our Nityananda Prabhu. He also met the Jagai Madhai. Of course, he delivered them. Nityananda Prabhu is so kind that in spite of being stroked and blood came out from his head, still he continued to say, My dear friends, never mind, you have injured me. You chant Hare Krishna. So the preaching is a difficult thing. Therefore, Krishna said, Nasatasman Manasya Shukastit me It is not very sitting idly comfortably and discuss Vedanta. No, it is not that. Preaching, practice. Practically meeting dangerous pollution. Because sympathy, samsara dama the whole world is in blazing fire. Paradukha Dukhi. Vaishnavi is Paradukha Dukhi. That is his qualification. For him, there is no difficulty. He is quite our life. He is under the protection of Krishna. Kaunte Apratijani hi nami bhakta prasa. So he has no danger, personally. What danger there? There is Krishna. He is confident. And Krishna protects him in all danger. But he is unhappy. He meets Jalai Madai class and faces all kinds of danger. Therefore, he is the powerful, authorized agent of Krishna. Thank you.